There are now 10 major fires burning across the Northwest. The Pole Creek Fire near Sisters has grown again. It's now about 24,000 acres. Smoke was a real problem overnight because of an inversion layer. The fire is only 40% contained, but crews have had to move some of their equipment to help with other fires. The cause of that blaze is still not known. It started on September 9th. Crews working the Cascade Creek Fire near Mount Adams are optimistic about the weather today. And here's a crazy statistic. There are 27 miles of fire hose being used on this one to fight the fire. This one started by lightning on Saturday, September 8th. And that same storm ignited more than 200 other wildfires across eastern Washington. And now to central Washington, more evacuation notices, as many as 200 issued because of the Wenatchee and the Table Mountain fires actually growing toward one another. As Coin Local 6 correspondent Monique Ming Lavin reports, there are also growing concerns about the firefighters who have been battling this big blaze for weeks. So many of them have been fighting wildfires all summer, going from one to the next to the next. Most stay in these tent cities right now, and there are just two shifts. They're either eating and sleeping or out on the fire lines. The concern that they've reached a tipping point. The fire is so hot and heavy, people are really paying attention to a lot of their safety factors. It's when it starts to go down that people start to let their guard up. And, and the fatigue, if they start to get tired, then they may start to let their guard up. So, um, you know, we really want people to pay attention and, and take the rest times. The uh, fires, the Table Mountain and the Wenatchee Complex fires were both started by lightning.